I had some fun buying silver this week. So, I got some good purchases this week and I want to share it with you guys. Show you what I got. And it is a $10 a week challenge. I'll start off with that, I guess. But, I got some more Newfoundland coins. I paid $6, just getting that out there. $30 a coin still. And that leaves me with $26.25 going into next week. So I'm pretty happy about that. The little cash reserve is growing there. But, here is... what I got. Hold on, I'm just gonna double check the year on this. <laughs> so 1945. There we go. Finally is showing for you guys. But, we got some more Newfoundland coins. As you could tell, this is in pretty good shape. I do like to pick out the nice ones, obviously. So I'm pretty happy about this. So I got another 5 cent piece, I'm going to be adding that to the stack. And I got another real nice 10 cent piece. Check that out. That is just gorgeous. The toting on this, it's just, it's not colorful or anything, but just nice toning in the just right where you want it to be just the right amount so that'd be a 43 Newfoundland dime these are sterling silver now what I got for the other part of the stack I know you guys will enjoy one of my favorite, basic, this could be my favorite series, I don't know. But it's the Lion of Judah. Very happy about this. This would be the 2018. As I mentioned before, I was going to go back and go to the beginning, start from the beginning and work my way backwards again. So I did get the 2018. And I am very happy to have that in. And it is it's a really <clears throat> a really amazing coin. That's old Betty's mug shots not what you want to see, you wanna see this side, I, but everything about it's nice, like even just the design of the lion. Lions are one of my favorite animals. I love how they did the mane on this. And just look at him. This lion definitely lifts. He is jacked. Look at that. Yeah, I'd say that guy lifts. <laughs> but... Yeah, I'm pretty happy about that. And then I did get a few other pieces too, but... I basically turned them all into these. Although I would... I'm not gonna do, be melting this. The Lion of Judah, no way. So this would be... The only one that is basically staying here for my son. Yeah, I don't even get to keep the four, number four bar. My son wanted that one out of all of them, so... Hey, he took my number four, so... It's all good, though. But I'm pretty happy about these bars. They're turning out real nice. I am very happy about it. And I'm having a lot of fun with the pouring. So, those Engelhard bars, 
I got an offer that I could not refuse. I was going to melt them anyways. I was offered 5 ounces for 4 of those bars. So ba basically trading an ounce for an ounce and a quarter. I'm happy with that. And if s someone wants the collector bars, hey, I got it. That was the cheapest silver I could find. I think I got pretty lucky with that, but... Yeah, so those Engelhards did survive. Don't hate me for melting the Engelhards. But that basically sums it all up. I did melt the Sunshines, the TD bars though, that I showed you guys. A few other things. I turned some Beaver Boolean bars into Mel Stacks Beaver bars. <laughs> and yeah, I'm having a lot of fun with that. So let me know if you want one though. I I'm gonna keep pouring more. I'm probably gonna do a like a hundred or so of these. I'm thinking a hundred's probably a good number of those bars. But I'm letting you guys pick whatever number you want. I'm already I'm only gonna be pouring a hundred, but I had a hundred and thirty-eight as a number on one of the bars. So that is kind of something unique that I am going to do. You could choose 1,000 if you want. As long as the, I can fit the number stamping it on the bar, you can choose it, but I'm pretty much just making 100. That's the plan. So, if you want one, send me an email. It's down in the description below. It's on my About page. Go send me an email. I'm more than happy to help everyone out, get them a Mel Stacks bar. So, hope you guys enjoyed. This is what I got this past week. The $10 week stack is growing pretty good. I am very happy about the Roaring Lion of Judah. It is just stunning. And as you guys can see here, one other thing about this coin is the micro engraving. You see the writing right on his hair there? So that just says, and the truth shall set you free. And yeah, this is a real nice coin. Very happy about it. And yeah, I'm just seeing it. One thing that just blew me away though here is just seeing how Jack the Lion is. It just blew me away. <laughs> but, yeah. Please like, share, subscribe. Stay tuned for the 500 subscriber giveaway. There is quite a few answers in the box. Up to almost three and a half. Gonna get some more in there pretty soon before I hit 500 subscribers. And, yeah. Stay positive. See you next time. Thanks. Bye.